is a really good point for us to now transition onto my new thing, <laughs> the uh, trivia side of this conversation. Ooh. So, and I've got even more fancy as well. So the idea here is just to like, um, you, I love the conversation that we've had, but it's just to loosen things up a little bit and just, I want to see how much you really know about Zambia. Okay. So um, I love it because we all have this great interest in Zambia, but let's see like just how much you, you've, you've ingested over your years and I'll let you bring it on. Bring it on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So how, how much do you really know Zambia? Let's see. What is your favorite food? Let's start there. What's your favorite Zambian food? Impwa. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, what is your favorite Zambian name? Chibuta. Okay. That's, That's my name. Oh, interesting. I love the responses. I swear it's, it's so enlightening <laughs> when people tell you these things. I like that. I remember my first car was Chibuta. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this part is called this or that. Which one do you prefer? Okay. So Lusaka or Livingston? Livingston. Ooh. Hands down. Whitewater rafting on the Victoria Falls or game viewing at Luangwa National Park? Whitewater rafting. Okay. Why? Um, exhilarating. I think you may have seen I was at the Angels Pool and oh yeah uh, yeah i'm a, i'm one of those that like exhilarating experiences game viewing is cool but whitewater rafting is more um maybe you also you're, comp you're competitive <laughs> you see? you're trying to deny you're competitive <laughs> okay so which skirt wearing men are more attractive right zambian tonga men or tonga men that is so don't worry. Funny. I won't I won't let you answer that. You don't the to. Tonga <laughs> Bulls. The Tonga Bulls, huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Zambia before China or Zambia after China? Neither. Neither. Okay. But I would mm -hmm. say, um, I would say Zambia before China. I do think that the Chinese have elements that they bring in terms of like work ethic and stuff like that but i would say maybe zambia before china i don't know what zambia after china looks like so i don't know well the way it is right now you know a lot of the stuff and the growth and most of that development has been really because of the you know the chinese dollar let's say yeah but the uh, quality yeah. of that growth is not necessarily admirable i don't know i just That's think it. that um yeah you know this one is a very political question okay <laughs> But that's what, that's the point. I want and to be political, and I'm apolitical. <laughs> okay, so now it's getting tougher now. Okay, so Zambia has the largest underground mine in Africa. Did you know that? Is it quantum? Well, you're, the question is, which mine is it? Now, quantum isn't a mine; it's a company. Yeah, but they. So, own... which mine is it? I I don't know the mine names. I don't know my names. I just know the companies. So I would okay. think it's owned by Quanta, maybe. Okay, I don't know which mine is Quanta owns. But it's Mufulira mine. So the yep. largest underground mine in Africa is Zambia's Mufulira wine. In and it Africa, employs, that's a good one. Yes. And it employs 10,000 people. Um, and the mine includes this concentrator, a refinery, and a smelter. And it produces 300,000 tons of copper each year. So we just have Sorry. to find out who owns it. Yes, I'll, I'll do that. I'll do that for sure. <laughs> I, I bet people will start commenting anyway, so that's fine. Okay, can you name the eight countries that border Zambia? Okay, Mozambique, Angola, Botswana, Zimbabwe, Congo, Malawi. How many did I name? Six. Um, Good. Namibia? Yes. And uh, two, 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 two. who did I leave out? Um, I was trying to go clockwise in my head, but um, I guess my clock's at 11. I don't know the say, last one. Did you say Angola? I did say Angola. Okay. Wow. I said Congo. I, I didn't say Tanzania. Tanzania. Yeah, there we go. Okay. You said Tanzania. Well I said Tanzania. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad, right? Well, I'm impressed. Look at you. <laughs> Good. I'm impressed. Okay, so give me one fun fact that you know about Zambia. 
fun fact about Zambia, 70, over 72 languages, kind of scary, right? Yes, it is. It yeah. is. It's quite fascinating as well. Yeah. Okay, last one. If you could invite three Zambians on a safari, uh, to a safari lodge for a long weekend, who would you invite and why? Living or dead? Uh, any. Your choice. Zambians, I would invite um, Luquesa. Brack, okay. I would invite you. Why? And oh! why. I haven't finished. I haven't finished. And why? And then... Um, you as well um because there's just idea generation but also getting stuff done aspects but also i believe in having fun i mean life is short so you got to have a good time Absolutely. and i believe in the future of the of the of the country but not necessarily driven by those quote unquote leaders but people that are really influential leaders mm -hmm. that makes sense as well yeah yeah, yeah. Oh! Oh, fascinating. When are we going? <laughs> Listen, I'll be booking the trip soon. Don't you worry. We are going to Livingston in July. So maybe we can, you know, do something yeah. while we're there. Oh, yeah. lovely. I like that. I'm all excited now. <laughs>